First up, DIY Thin Mints. Thin Mints happen to be my favorite, but this is my last box, so if this recipe works, I might be rich. The jackpot recipe, butter, powdered sugar, cocoa powder, vanilla, flour, and of course, peppermint. Mmm, smells like Thin Mints. Just like the video, roll them flat. If you don't have a rolling pin, flatten it with your clean hand. Cut them out into two inch cookies. Then just throw them in the oven. Dip them in melted chocolate. Like that's a lot. And let that harden. Fabulous. It's not a thin mint though, it's a thick mint. Next up, tag along pound cake. Peanut, butter, peanut, butter. <laughs> Melt some peanut butter with actual butter and powdered sugar. Pretty big cookie to peanut butter ratio here. Melt some chocolate, layer it on top, and let that harden. No, just tastes like peanut butter on pound cake. <laughs> I'm gonna say this is a fail. Consistency of the peanut butter with the pound cake is just a little off. Last up, Samoa donuts. What we're about to make is basically Samoas on steroids. The video starts by topping them off with some melted caramel. No way, I'm making real donuts, so I just bought some from the store. Layer on shredded coconut mixed with more melted caramel. Just like the bottom of a Samoa cookie, it is covered in chocolate, so we gotta do the same for our donuts. Lastly, drizzle some chocolate on top. It tastes just like the cookie. That is fabulous, really messy, not healthy at all. Fabulous. I need some milk. Beating the Girl Scout cookie blues. Look, big Samoa, baby Samoa. Fab or fail style. 